the skin I'm showing you on screen right now scream Power Rangers to you? Most likely you're gonna say no. I mean, if you, if you know what you think about the skin Ryu, it is Street Fighter. This is not Power Rangers at all, right? Even in the edit styles, you have Battle Street Fighter Ryu, right? You, you, there is no Power Rangers here. However, you may have been keeping up to leaks and stuff recently and heard about how there's going to be a sh uh, Power Ranger collaboration in the very near future. And according to the new information that has recently dropped on social media, it appears that it's Street Fighters X Power Rangers X Fortnite. That sounds very weird, so let me just go ahead and show this on screen right now. We had a rumor from Xbox Era a little bit ago talking about Power Rangers coming to Fortnite. Xbox Era also had rumors recently about, you know, Pirates of the Caribbean and uh, Avatar, and both of those appear to be happening with the new Disney collaboration. But it recently has been spotted on Bad in the Sun's Instagram story that Crimson Hawk is set to come to Fortnite. As you can see right here, it says the characters we co-created and named is coming to Fortnite Crimson Hawk with Power Rangers X Fortnite right there, and, you know, tagging Peter Jang official. Or I guess if we look at the second image, though, you may notice Crimson Hawk isn't just your ordinary Power Ranger. This is Ryu Crimson Hawk, because this is the Power Ranger that was a collaboration with Street Fighter. So hearing that we are getting Power Rangers kind of confirmed, basically, right here, coming to Fortnite in the near future, but hearing how it might not be the original Power Rangers you're thinking of or whatever else, but instead... Street Fighter Power Rangers just it, it just sounds very odd to me, right? It sounds like something that is like out of a fever dream or, or anything, but at the exact same time, it is very intriguing to see how this has actually been announced and how it could be coming to the game very, very soon. Now, of course, we don't know when soon is, right? With a lot of these leaks and stuff, sometimes they don't come out for one to two years. We have to wait a very, very long time. And I mean, even in game right now, you know, it's like we don't have any files that could be Power Rangers related. It's mainly just Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle right now, but but hearing more confirmation and hearing more officially sounding news that isn't just, you know, a rumor going around definitely adds up to the realness of what's going on here and definitely makes me wonder how they're actually going to execute this collaboration. Doesn't mean we're going to be seeing the return of the Street Fighter cosmetics in the item shop like Blanca, like Kami, Chun-Li, Sakura, you know, are we going to be seeing all these skins actually releasing in the item shop again and are we going to be getting more? than just Crimson Hawk, right? Because there's, for example, like a Chun-Li version of Power Rangers. Are we going to be getting all of these characters right here if they have Power Ranger versions with Power Ranger edit styles or maybe a Power Ranger item shop skin or something else? We really don't know, but it is very interesting to actually see this news kind of drop out of the blue, right? It was just posted on an Instagram story like 16 hours ago. That's kind of like, hey, characters we co-created. Yeah, they're gonna drop of the game. You know, nothing too crazy there. And now for the second part of the video, I kind of just have a little bit of a ramble regarding the whole entire Power Rangers collaboration because I actually had a little bit of a discussion or I saw some friends having a discussion on another server regarding the whole entire rumor from Xbox era of Power Rangers coming to the game. And honestly, I think having like the Street Fighter Power Rangers crossover skin coming to the game instead of like the original Power Rangers might be a little bit of a better choice for Epic Games to actually do because of the fact that apparently a lot of the actual Power Rangers from, you know, the original Power Rangers shows and everything have had a lot of bad things that have happened to them, right? Because in this little note and on my other monitor here, I can actually see that apparently a couple of Power Rangers have been guilty of murder, so there'd be a 50-50 shot that if we had the normal Power Rangers coming to the game, there would have been a real-life killer in the item shop, right? And that's something that, you know, we probably won't want to see in the game. There's also been situations where apparently there was one of the Power Rangers who stole a signed donation art piece that was meant for charity, so there's a lot of controversy going on with the actors of the original Power Rangers and everything else, so I definitely see this as a safer bet for Epic Games to do it in order to bring back some older collaboration cosmetics while also going ahead and releasing their own ones. So I would love to hear in the comments down below, what do you think about this whole entire situation? What do you think about us potentially just getting the Power Ranger collaboration in the form of Street Fighter only? And do you feel that this is something that is kind of exciting? Or do you feel that it's a little bit of a gut punch because you wanted the original Power Rangers instead of the Power Rangers that were kind of a spin-off of another game, you know, being combined? Because this might be the first time in Fortnite history, if it comes true, that that we end up having a collaboration, which is a mixture of two different collaborations in one. It's just something I never would have thought I would have mentioned or, you know, talked about on this channel, but here we are. Now, with that said, however, the same day that this video goes live on YouTube is the same day that the brand new Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle Ooze War mini event questline goes live, so I hope you champs and jambits are enjoying that. I hope the video the other day got you excited for all the free rewards and everything, and I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your days. Until next time, I'll catch you guys a little bit later with another upload. Like the video if you liked it, dislike it if you didn't like it, and peace out.